OK, so this video is look at unofficial Visionaries animal figures. I've done a few videos about Visionaries as it was one of my favourite cartoons from the 80s. I collected the action figures as a kid, which were good, but they had at least one aspect of them which was disappointing. In the show all their characters could turn into animals to fight or escape, but the figures had nothing to represent them in their animal form. It was really disappointing and frustrating. Even more so when decades later I saw the figures to the film The Golden Compass, which allowed animals to go with the human characters. Why couldn't they have done that with visionaries in the 80s, as turning into animals was one of the big gimmicks of the show. It still bothers me to this day, as visionaries deserve better. I've thought about buying animal models from my local toy shop to put with my visionaries figures to finally make them complete, but they were just too expensive for non-articulated models. But I've been a collector my whole life and I've got quite a few animals in my collection, so instead I'll use them, and here are the results. I can't do all of them, but I can do most. So starting with the good guys, the Spectral Knights, he's the leader Leoric, who can turn into a lion. So for his animal form, I'd use this lion figure, which is actually Aslan, from the Lion, the Witch and the Wardrobe film. It's a bit on the big side, but it's articulated, so better than those rip-off models I've seen. This is Whitterquick, who can turn into a cheetah. The closest thing I can find to that is a snow leopard from the aforementioned The Golden Compass. This is Arzon, who can turn into an eagle. So for him, I use this falcon, which is actually Red Wing, the bird psychic to Marvel superhero the falcon. It looks a lot like an eagle to me. This is Crytek, who can change into a polar bear. And as luck would have it, I've got this articulated polar bear figure, again from the Golden Compass. And this is Ektar, who was an eBay buy when I tried to expand my visionaries figures. That's why he has no weapon. He turns into a fox, and I don't have one of those. But there's a character called Feral who can turn into a wolf. So just pretend for a moment this is Feral. Because I use this wolf figure for his animal form, which is also from the Golden Compass. On to the villains now, the Duckling Lords. Here's Sindar, who can turn into a gorilla. So for that, I'd use this King Kong figure from the Peter Jackson film. This is Cravex, who can turn into a Phylot, which looks like a pterodactyl. This is the only pterodactyl I've got, an extremely small one from Jurassic World, but it will have to do. And lastly, he's Mortred, who was another eBay buy, hence no weapons again, and he turns into a beetle. So for him, I'd use this bug figure, which was from the King Kong line again. I think visionaries look a lot better with their animal forms, but they should have come with them in the first place. Ok, so that was a look at unofficial visionaries animal figures, and hopefully you'll join me on another video sometime.